Jennifer Aniston's comments regarding influencer culture and how young people acquire fame has sparked a backlash. During an Actors on Actors interview with Variety, Aniston, 53, discussed her hopes for success in the year 2022 with 39-year-old Sebastian Stan. She spoke on how personalities like Paris Hilton and Monica Lewinsky ascended to fame with the rise of the internet culture. During one portion of the interview, the two were talking about the notorious sex tape leak involving Pamela Anderson and Tommy Lee Jones in 1995, which served as the inspiration for Stan's Hula series. This prompted Aniston to talk about the culture of the internet during that time period. Aniston started to comment on how the leak occurred during a time when the internet began to influence society, as she stated, It was right at the time when the internet really shaped a new culture about people becoming famous. Aniston was referring to the idea that the leak occurred when the internet was beginning to exert its influence on society. This thing of people becoming famous for basically doing nothing, but yet having these incredible careers, and then women's reputation, I mean... Paris Hilton, Monica Lewinsky, all those. Lewinsky was involved in a sex scandal with the then-president Bill Clinton in 1998 after his two-year relationship with a 24-year-old White House intern came to light, while Paris Hilton's private sex tape featuring herself and then-boyfriend Rick Salmon was leaked onto the internet in 2004. Stan replied, When you look back at the 90s, you do see how many things have happened in that decade. Even the O.J. Simpson thing was actually the beginning of the 24-hour news. His comment led the Horribly Bosses star to add, I feel so lucky that we got a little taste of the industry before it became what it is today. More streaming services. You're famous from TikTok. You're famous from YouTube. You're famous from Instagram. It's about like it's diluting the actor's job. The Just Go With It stars comment soon sparked a furious response from some Twitter users who felt the Hollywood star's reflections about finding fame were ironic due to the fact that her parents are late actress Nancy Dow and Days of Our Lives star John Aniston, 88. One fan tweeted, Jennifer Aniston plays the same character, which is just a version of herself in every movie, and it consistently gives nothing. The only thing that saves her is she has pretty okay co-stars to save as comic relief. Always the nepotism babies, with no talent wanting to give their take. Another wrote, Jennifer Aniston needs to calm down with her opinions with her nepotism when her nepotism got her into the industry and now she continues to make $20 million per year just off syndications from a show that ended decades ago. They're so mad they can't gatekeep the title of celebrity to stay in their weird nepotism Hollywood elite. Sick, another Twitter user stated. One fan mused, Jennifer Aniston, nepotism baby, not talking about the true injustice of the acting industry, nepotism, and instead pretending the acting profession is degraded when people from all walks of life have the opportunity to become actors based on their own hard work and virality. Sick. Another added, I feel so lucky that nepotism got me in before TikTok, YouTube, Twitch, and other services gave other people the opportunity to be seen. I would have never been able to compete against such a candidate pool. Jennifer Aniston, basically. However, some fans spoke out in defense of the Marley and Me star, claiming she was right to say that internet platforms had allowed influencers to get roles traditionally given to actors. She's not wrong. The early OOs was revolutionizing. You actually had to have talent, one person commented. Another added, she kind of has a point though. Trained actors and those just coming out of training have been getting sidelined for influencers with no training whatsoever for a while now. And it's happening across the board, no matter the race class. Aniston's parents divorced when she was nine years old and the actress had an estranged relationship with her father who initially discouraged her from pursuing acting. In 2012, the Bounty Hunter star told The Hollywood Reporter, My dad's advice has always been, don't do it, become a doctor, become a lawyer. He didn't want me to be heartbroken because he knew it was a tough business. It compelled me to go for it even harder. 
do what keeps you happy and don't ever let people box you in. However, the veteran actor was supportive of her career once she began to make her name in Hollywood.